The shops at Montebello, formerly the Montebello Town Center, is a shopping mall that opened in 1985. If you've clicked onto this video, then you know what today is. It's Monday, 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 Monday Mall Madness. Every Monday I'll be releasing a new video on a defunct or maybe not so defunct mall and its history. Make sure you stick around at the very end of the videos. I'd like to see if you, the viewer, are paying attention. So if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and smash that notification bell so you get notified of my latest mall video, defunct store, or my throwback Thursday videos. Leave a suggestion or a comment for a future video. Thanks. Five on the site of an old Chevron oil field in Montebello, California. Construction of the mall began in 1980 and was completed in 1985, just in time for the 1985 holiday season. The mall developers tried to create a Main Street turn-of-the-century atmosphere, breaking up the vast interior promenades with clusters of street lamps, tall trees, and park benches. Town Center, though, could not be any farther from the center of Montebello and still be in town. Like an outpost, the modern shopping mecca sat atop a hill at the northernmost edge of the city, beckoning commuters off the Pomona Freeway in the gully below. Town Center's developers incorporated the kind of 1980s amenities designed to lure shoppers to a mall and keep them inside for a long time. There were benches on which to sit and rest those weary feet, high glass ceilings flood the two-story mall with light, and the food court glass wall allows diners to view the outdoors from inside the unusual atrium-like three-level space. Montebello Town Center is nestled up against the hills in the heart of the San Gabriel Valley, eight miles east of downtown Los Angeles. The $95 million, 850,000 square foot center included 168 specialty stores and restaurants on a 54 acre site with surface parking for 3,900 cars. The two-level mall opened with three anchor stores, a 139,000 square foot JCPenney, a 122,000 square foot May Company, and an 84,000 square foot Mervins. During the 1980s, you may have remembered such stores as Motherhood Maternity, as well as The Dark Alley, which featured artsy greeting cards, party favors, black wrought iron candlesticks, up to the minute fashion watches, and risque posters. There was also Lotus, an Asian gift store stocked to the ceiling with jade jewelry, antiques, vases, lamps, miniature carvings, and other art objects. Other in stores included The Limited, Kinney's Shoes, Mrs. Fields Cookies, Miller's Outpost, and Marie Callender's. In 1993, May Company closed and would reopen as Robinson's May. In 2001, Macy's built a new store and opened as the fourth anchor. In 2006, the Robinson's May store closed and reopened as Macy's, with the former Macy's building being remade into a Macy's home store. In 2008, Mervyn's went out of business and closed. The former Mervyn space became a Forever 21 in 2009. A comprehensive remodel was almost totally completed in 2009 in time for the winter holidays. The remainder of the remodel was completed in June of 2010 and it included an elegantly styled center court with more than high-end stores such as Coach Fine Leathers and Aldo Fashion Footwear. Many of the stores were also remodeled as well, including the Disney store. 
Around this time, the Montebello Town Center was renamed the Shops and Montebello. The mall was again remodeled in 2016. The food court was renovated along with the enhanced entryways, landscaping, signage, and outdoor seating. The anchor store H&M was also remodeled. In April of 2022, a local investor bought the 55-acre shops at Montebello for more than $90 million. Today, the shops at Montebello is a modern indoor super regional shopping center that features Macy's, Macy's Home, H&M, Forever 21, and JCPenney, as well as Coach, plus more than 160 specialty retailers. The mall also features several restaurants such as Lucille's Smokehouse Barbecue, as well as BJ's Restaurant. Congratulations, you made it this far into the video. When I find you, pop quiz, hot shot. So let's see how close you were paying attention to my video. So how many anchor stores closed in this mall? So if your answer was three, give yourself a hand. You were paying attention. Thanks for watching. So what do you remember about this mall? Be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment or a suggestion for a mall from your childhood, or how about your favorite mall? Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to Eric C Productions.